Merry Christmas. Welcome back to Bucks County Beer Reviews. I'm recording this on Sunday morning. Uh, we got a rainy day in store here. It's a good day to be in the beer basement. It's a good day for a good beer. And hopefully this is one. Uh, it's from one of my favorite breweries, Fatheads, out of Middleburg Heights, Ohio. They uh, seem to specialize in hoppy, big hoppy IPAs. They do some other things too, but I'm always finding good uh, hoppy IPAs that I like from there. This one's an Imperial India Pale Ale at 9% ABV. It's called Hop Juju. Uh, on the can it says reckless use of hops around the top. And what else does it say? Brewed and canned by Fatheads Brewery, Middleburg Heights, Ohio. Keep your can off the streets. Please recycle your empties. I always do. And it says, chill out, man. Have a beer. That's what I plan on doing. This one gets great scores on untapped. Uh, 4.22 with 52,955 ratings. Um, <clears throat> what it says, uh, what I found on untapped about this is, it's a supernatural beer with a powerhouse of hops, creating aromas and flavors of citrus, pine, and tropical fruits with a juicy, resiny hop finish. Special thanks to our loyal fans for the cult-like following. Cult-like as in juju. Hop juju. All right, let's get it out of this can. You know, I don't... This has been in my fridge for over a month maybe six weeks. I just can't get caught up. And you know what? Even though I know I'm not getting caught up, I keep buying more beer. And then people very kindly send me beer. And I just resign myself that I'll never be caught up. And I'll just do the best I can. Yeah, this one was canned, I believe, at the end of August. So it's getting a little age to it. Uh, I think I bought a six pack of this. I forgot the price, darn it. Uh, it wasn't outrageous. And I drank the other five. I already know I like the beer. But getting around to reviewing it, just, uh, I can only do so many. It has a nice tropical, fruity aroma of hops. I suppose we should look at it before I start tasting it. It's clear. You know, there's very tiny bubbles coming up. They're hard to see on the camera, but they're there. The head is a nice fluffy, foamy. Give it a swish and get the last of it in there. Pillowy. Pillowy head. See that? All right, here we go. The head uh, has a robust hoppy flavor. Not much bitterness in the head though. Nice tropical flavors. And a little bit of bitterness. Let's get into the body. Cheers. Um, I, f I know it says it on here. I forgot to read it. It does say 9% ABV and 90 IBUs. That's one thing I like about Fatheads. Uh, they, they do put the IBUs on the cans. Now this one, I think the age has dimmed it a little bit. Because it's not as bitter as I remember the first can that I drank probably five or six weeks ago. But it's still coming across as fairly bitter tropical, the kind of things you would expect West Coast, you know. Um, I like it. Unfortunately, I liked it more <clears throat> when I first bought it, but I have to grade it on what it is now. It's very easy to drink for a 9%er. There's no alcohol flavor. So, you know, those are the kinds that can get you into trouble. 
Got to be smart. It is, uh, I'm sure a lot of people would still find it very bitter. To me, it's moderately, on the upper end of moderate. And Untap gives it a 4.22. The way it is now, I'll give it a 4. It's still a very good beer. I do recommend trying this or any other beer from Fathead's Brewery if you can get them. And that's it. I give it a four. Easy to drink. Really easy. Going down too easy. Okay, I know we had one of these before. Another one. Uh, got a lot of Australian cans coming in. 4X Light. Uh. Excuse me. Uh, Might have had this one before. I don't remember. Okay, I know we've had a couple of these, but this one is different on the back. <clears throat> Adelaide, March 1980. 21st Highland Games. Okay. Be kind of glad when this box is done. Here's a West End Export Beer with a rugby theme. I think I did one of these already. This can is a nice can. It's dirty though. I need to wash it. Cascade Draught. Like I, I think I said before, I love beer cans that have a picture of a glass of beer on the can. There's something about them. I just like the way they look. Brewed and canned by Tasmanian Breweries, Hobart, Australia. I'm going to clean that one up and I'll show it again after I clean it. Put it right there. Another dirty can, Cascade Inter-Dominion Lager. Got horse racing theme on there. Can you see that? Uh, Tasmanian Breweries in Hobart, Australia. I'll clean that one too. Let's do one more. TAA Airbus. It's a, it's a beer. Oh, it's a KB Tooth's Lager. Tooth KB Lager, and this one is about an Airbus airplane. Maybe they serve these on the airlines, I don't know. All right, that's going to do it. Thanks for watching, everybody. Hop Juju, I lost that can now. There it is. Hop Juju. I'll give it a four, but I think it's better than that if you get it fresh. All right, thanks for watching. Merry Christmas. Happy New Year and all that good stuff. Um, go Eagles. Bye-bye.